last week I ran an 800 and I had planned for that to be my last race before my trip to Mexico next week but at the last minute I just decided to do a 1500 today here in Bristol. I finished about 30 minutes ago, I'm just about to do my cool down. So here's how the race went. <laughs> today. It wasn't a very quick time but at least it was quicker than the last 1500 I've done. Quite windy around that back straight over there, that wind was really quite strong. The thing is I went off at the right sort of pace, went through in about 71, 72, about what I wanted to do really. Didn't feel too bad, then I started to feel quite tired. I went through 800 in about 230, 229, which, so I slowed a bit. Then that third lap I lost contact with people and I had no one to run with. Didn't really have the strength or motivation to push. I felt very very heavy and very tired today. I and mean, then even that last lap, I couldn't really pick it up much. But 4.43 is faster than it was by four seconds a few weeks ago. It's not even a season best or anything, but it will do. <laughs> As you can see, it wasn't brilliant, it wasn't as bad as the other week, but I just felt really tired today. Running 4.43 was, you know, okay I guess. It's the same time I ran at the British Masters Champs. It's my second fastest time of the year, so I can't really complain. Anyway, in a week's time I go to Mexico, hopefully try and get some more training in. It's going to be hot, it's going to be like 35 to 40 degrees, that's going to hurt, that's going to be horrible. I'm going to get on with a cool down, and that's it for this section of the season. Next is Mexico, two weeks of training, two and a half weeks come back I've got three weeks British Masters Champs and that's the end of the season so I look forward to it and I'll see you soon bye